Let's try another one. What if I want four and seven? Let's write it down. A square bracket, comma. And now we only have one row, right? It's the first row here. So we're going to write down one on the left hand side of this comma. And on the right hand side, it will be the columns. And the columns now is the second column and the third column. So we're going to write down two, column three, indicating this is column two, two, column three. And left hand side, this is row one. And in R, it will give us four and seven. What if we want four, five, seven, eight? So let's write it down. It will be A square bracket, comma, and now our data is in two rows and two columns in row one and row two and column two and column three. So we are going to write on the left hand side of the comma one, two, two means row one to row two. Okay, so on the right hand side of the comma, we are going to write down two, two, three, indicating it's from column two to column three. And it will give us a matrix four, five, seven, eight. What if we want one, two, seven, eight? We are going to write down A square bracket, comma. Now the data highlighted are in row one and row two. So we are going to write down one, two, two. This means row one, two, row two. But the data are separated in two different columns and they are not adjunct. This is column one and column three. So we are going to write C, one and three. It means we'll only choose from column one and column three and then combine them together. In R, it will give us one, two, seven, eight. Okay, that's it. That's how you slice the data in R with their location number. Thank you.